Hi, my name is Vanessa, and I'm from Brownsville, Texas. I've been collecting dolls since I was a teenager. The doll that I have here today, she was originally a Kirsten doll from 1986. Uh, she was from Pleasant Company, and you can notice that she's from Pleasant Company because she has no body tag on the side of her body, and she also has a marking on the back of her neck that says Pleasant Company. Okay, so when I got her from eBay, she came to me with um, no clo with a decent outfit, but she had no face paint on whatsoever. Her body limbs are pretty tight, so she can stand on her own. But when she um, arrived to me, she had no eyebrows and she had no lips. So I went with a paintbrush and I thinly painted out each eyebrow, each individual lash with a brown mixed black acrylic. And I also did the same thing with her freckles. And I mixed an orange and red color to make her lips. And everything was sealed with a Mod Podge sealant and her, and, uh, her lips were sealed uh, with a triple thick glaze to get that glossy look that is on her lips while everything else just had a multi-purpose sealant after the Mod Podge so it has a satin finish. Her hair, if, uh, you remember Kirsten dolls they have blonde hair and they have two braids that are looped on either side of her head but her hair was very damaged. I tried fixing it but nothing worked and it was very thin practically falling apart. So what I did, I got, I bought two weaves on eBay and they were for about $10 and this hair usually costs about $30 um, for two packs of hair. And so it's a long weave and I uh, glued around her head in a spiral motion until I got to the very tip of her head and I glued on a uh, weave closure, which is a patch of hair that hides the weave and that way you can separate her hair in any direction and you cannot see the weave, you only see hair. And you can style, you can do a lot more styles because you won't see the head and in um, American Girl Dolls, their hair are, we are wigs, so when you separate the hair, sometimes you'll see the wig cap. And so I decided I would go with a weave because you can't see any wig cap and you can't see any part of her head. All you see is hair. So it makes styling a lot more easier. Her outfit is partly American Girl clothes and partly clothes that's uh, from generic brands. This is from one of the outfits that comes with the sundress. And her shoes come from the outfit Licorice Play. And her top and uh, cami, they're from eBay. It cost me like $4. And her jeans are a generic brand that were from also from eBay that cost me $9. Her jewelry are things that I made. I made her this bracelet sort of friendship bracelet and I put a little bit of crystals at the end. I made her a peace sign a necklace with a spiral design and I also pierced her ears using a thumbtack and I made these earrings myself and I put them on her ears. So that's my Kirsten doll remade. Thank you for watching.